Hello everyone, and today we're playing Amnesia, and today we're playing an Amnesia custom story called Obscurity. So yeah, so um, we are back from the last episode, we went in there, and we dealt with some dangerous monsters. And now we're gonna start this up, uh, uh, do this again, so we need to go back to our house to get a key. We're gonna have to do a puzzle, which is gonna drive me insane, but you know... Welcome to Amnesia sometimes. It can't be. It's probably not that bad. Well, it can be really bad, but it's probably gonna be just medium. Okay, hello, barrels. Okay, gonna close that. Don't want anything to come up. Okay, so apparently what we need to do is unlock that. Nope. What? What? Oh, crap. Ow. Oh. Okay, so we'll be right back in this area because apparently I, um, need to do other stuff before going into this area. And first, let's, let's put this book right and, uh, here. There we go. Yay! Perfect. Okay, be right back. Ow. Okay, we're gonna go over there. Okay, oh. Uh, we're gonna go over there now. We need to use those keys for those doors. So I'm sorry, everyone. I uh, had it wrong. <laughs> no music playing? Okay. Understood. Understood. Now let's go over here. Ah, the hell. There. Okay. Okay, paper. Uh, a book. There's no way entering there. Look, I don't think I can handle this anymore. We've gone too far. William, we can't stop now. You're fully aware of the consequences if we do. I know, but isn't there another way? No. We've tried everything. This is the only solution. Okay. So, what are they doing? It doesn't sound very good, if I want to be completely honest here. Okay, that's just paper. I forgot about that. Okay, um... Okay, books, 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 and tinderboxes. Let's put this book over here. Hello, other books. Okay, hello. Sheets. We'll put that up top of there. Hello. Okay, I love this room. It's, um, it's, just, it's very simple, which I love. Oh. Ah! Crap. Oh. Okay, so we got the red one. That's perfect. Okay. 
Okay, let's go to the hotel before we go to the next house, because I want, I want to see if there's anything in the hotel. Maybe like a little something I forgot, if we can go back to the hotel. I don't think I can. Might just have to climb up. Wait, did we saw the brute here at one of the windows? I swear there had to be like a brute we saw, you know, not a brute. The other, we saw another monster besides the flying creature. So I'm curious what that was. Okay, I will say this place has an interesting color palette. You know, like the colors are very interesting. And I love that moon. Moon, it's shining bright. Well, yeah. cries. Sorry, I had to say it. I had to. I had to. <laughs> oh, hello. Okay. I don't. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else we can really do here. I have... I need to be back to the... Okay. Stupid! Uh, we could just move the boxes. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Hello? Hello? Well... Okay, let's go. So there's nothing we can really do. Here we go. We basically used the same key there as well. Can't put those books back because, well, uh, literally a disaster zone occurred. <laughs> Looks like a, a really bad break-in. Okay, go into that door. I don't know if I do want to go into that door. There might be dead bodies. It seemed that there was blood all the way over there. To there, yeah. We can just clean up a little bit. Look at this. Look at this. What monster just made a mess like this? This place needs a little bit of cleaning up. It is ridiculous. It is absolutely, absolutely ridiculous that they have to do this. Okay. Could you just not ruin a nice bedroom? How dare these people. It's an outrage. This is an outrage. I demand a racist. Ooh. And we'll move this. Right over here. The power of Christ compels you. Hold on. Oh. We'll put it in the very top. The power of the Christ. I gotta stop being weird. <laughs> no. No. Stay. God, the physics sometimes can get very tricky wicky. Tricky wicky. Oh, hello, painting. Pluto? Pluto. Let's put... Let's put these chairs. Okay, we'll put these books up... We'll put these books right up top of here. Okay. Uh, 
Hello. Oh. Okay. Goodbye, house. Sorry that you got to, had to dealt with a lot of shit, but um, hopefully you take care. Okay, one more house we have to do, and then I think that is it. So I'm going to go off memory uh, on how to do the puzzle, uh, but if I don't, then you guys can just crack your butts off and, and I'll figure out how to do it. Now, why I couldn't move the bed the last time, so why is it different this time? So I think it's this... <gasps> oh my god, so yeah, I watched the video, and that appeared to help me, so... There. You can pause because I wonder if this note or not. Okay, we have the final lever. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Oh god, hide, 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 hide. Oh, Work okay. Hello, is anyone down here? Okay, bye. Oh, my God. Hell was that? Here, Elizabeth. I want you to have this necklace. It's very pretty. I like it very much. Thank you, Daddy. It's for your ceremony in a few days. I want you to look nice. I can't wait. Does Mommy know about it? Or how about Simon? No, but you can't tell them about it. It's supposed to be a surprise. Oh, okay. I do not like that. Oh God, sorry. That sounds very suspicious. I don't know. This is getting very sussy. I don't like it. I don't like it when it gets sussy. I like it when it gets toughy. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, we'll go. <laughs> oh, this damn puzzle. I just hate these puzzles. I think... Crap, I absolutely hate these p puzzles. I just. Oh, thank God. I hate those piece of shit puzzles. Those bloody puzzles. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, here we are in the mines. And it's not looking very good. Okay, pause because I'm going to read that video or not, or pause and read this note or not. God, I'm like, not able to speak today. We'll grab that, and place it over here. Okay. We'll place this over here, put that over there. And be done with the whole thing. Ah, 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 ah,
And we'll put you over here. Let's let's clean up this stuff every once in a while, you guys. Why are we why are we not clean up stuff? Okay, goodbye room. Come along now, Elizabeth, don't fall behind. I don't want like it down here. It's dark and these shoes hurt my feet. Just a little bit further, okay? Daddy, why do I have to wear this dress? It's too fancy. It's for the ceremony. You're supposed to dress up nice. If it's such an important ceremony, why isn't Simon coming? Your brother doesn't need to come. The ceremony is about you, remember? Yeah, but I still don't understand. Well, your father's not really explaining. Probably because he wants to kill ya. So. Ah. I'm sorry, but this is looking quite suspicious. <gasps> oh, oh! Oh my god! <sighs> okay, goodbye, hammer. Now, I need the lantern here because it is like pitch black down here. I don't like this. I have no clue where that was. Just ignore it. Oh my god, that's a barrel. It's a water monster in here. Yeah, we can't go over there because it's moving. So we need to find a way to turn it off. Okay. Yeah, I have turned off those things a couple of times in this playthrough of, of, of Amnesia. My first playthrough of the main game. I would like to play the main game again. Just for funsies. Oh, hello. Hi. This place is big. Well, hold on. Uh, before we go back there, I would like to check around some places. No, 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 no. Wait, we just went in circles? Okay, maybe we don't need the lights here. Oh, yeah, we did one in circles. I thought this was a new place. Oh, this place is... Might not actually be that big than I thought it was. Well, okay. Well. What the hell? 
Yeah, so we did win in circles. And we're going in circles again. Okay. So this place is not actually that big. Okay, I'm getting the outline. At first, I was like, where are we? You know, that's really creepy. That until you know where exactly you are, or when you start going in circles, it's like weird that you're like, your brain thinks that something's much bigger than it actually is, you know? I have noticed that, and it's like, wow, that's creepy. Why, why does our brains work that way? Well, it's probably because it's just, you know, sensor or not censoring, but like, no, you know, trying to recognize your surroundings, but I don't know. It's quite creepy to me. I'm just gonna say it. I'm just gonna say it. It's quite creepy to me. Composite because we're going to the- no, no, not. Okay, books, uh, books, uh, books, uh, books, uh, books. Big books, small books, everything books. Huh? <gasps> shit, shit, crap, shit, 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 shit! <laughs> you didn't hear me do that. I really got freaked out, you guys. I am such a baby with these games. What is... What? What is this place? Where? What? Can we need to bash that tube, I suppose? Bash it. Okay, water's going down. Don't like that pausing of the game. So, what is this place? Is it like a workplace? And strings. What are we supposed to use the strings for? <sighs> Do I like use the strings? Oh. Okay, before I pick up that note. Pause if you guys want to read that note or not. Okay. Really scared, you guys. Monsters, you know the, you know that the monster's gonna show up. I'm not going. I am. I, I. I meant I am going. The hell? Going or not going? We're going. <laughs> Where is he? Where? 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 Where is he? I have no clue where it is. My eyes are like broken. I can't tell where the thing is. Whatever. Just go in here. I don't see it. Shit. Oh, I thought that was something I needed to pick up. What is this? What? Okay. So far, this custom story has been very nice at getting us stuff. Okay, thank God I don't need to do some wacky puzzle. It's probably gonna be in the hallway. Not really in the mood. Hello. Just go. Yeah, we can't go there. Hmm. 
Okay. There's a crack in the wall, but that's okay. Hopefully it's not big enough to have a... A flying creature. You know, I'm very thankful this creature is not a catfish. I absolutely... Oh, God. I probably should not even be mentioning my fear of catfishes, because I know that someone's going to be uh, scaring the poop out of me. We've arrived. The others will be arriving shortly. The ceremony is about to begin. What others? Daddy, I want to leave. You'll be able to leave soon, Elizabeth. Just lie down on the table and drink this. After I finish, can I go home? Yes, of course you can, dear. This will only take a minute. That's a flat-out lie. And by the way, what I meant by uh, someone's going to do it is uh, as one, uh, some, uh, one of you are eventually going to prank me with a catfish. One of you watch your people that are watching me. Uh, well, probably not you guys, but someone in the family member. My family member might do it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. No one prank me, please. Don't put like a catfish or fake like stuffed animal catfish next to me don't do anything and definitely do not put a real catfish next oh mm. sorry i do not know why but catfishes really really bother me crap i can't even think about them my god why do they bother me so much I don't know why, but I, like, have a phobia of, like, catfishes. Like, catfishes really bother me. And I don't... I, I don't... I don't know. It's just... I don't want to say that they, you know, look scary because they're, you know, ugly, but... And they're not exactly ugly. Sometimes I find them really cute, but, um... But, God, I just don't know. I just don't know, but they really freak me out. Especially the gigantic one. The gigantic ones. Oh... God, they just s scare me more. If we ever have a pandemic of like in s creatures getting bigger, I'm gonna Hello? go crazy. Is that one there? Oh, please help me. Who's there? Simon? Is that you? How did you get down here? I, I haven't seen you since you were a child. Father? What happened? I'm... I'm trapped. A rock fell on my arm and crushed it. And I, I can't move. Please help me. I'll help you. But first, you have to tell me what really happened to Elizabeth. I... I, I killed her. Sacrificed her. I... I, I, I did what was necessary. Did what was necessary? What are you talking about? You murdered your own daughter. Please, please understand. They they made me do it. I, I I had no other choice. Who? Who made you do it? The the communion. I I was in too deep. They they told me there was no other way. And why should I trust you? <sighs> please, there there should be a saw in the lab. I. I must remove my arm. Retrieve it for me and I... and I'll tell you the rest. Okay. Hmm. So we're gonna pick up the key, but... Apparently, this is a decision where we can ha- I think this- we can have two end- Oh my god, that's my dogs. They scared the crap out of me. Apparently, there's a decision where we can make two, uh, things happen. Like, two endings. Maybe? I don't think that's so. Huh. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna save and- Right here, just in case there's another ending. Okay, so I am back. <sighs> when we're gonna go over here. Well, actually, it's not just catfish. I have a phobia of a lot of fishes. I don't know why, but fishes kind of 
I don't know why I just get really scared of fishes. Is there such a thing as a phobia of fishes? There has to be. I, I can't be insane. Am I insane? I don't know. <laughs> Crap. God bless it. That noise is scaring the shit out of me. Okay. Now, I wonder if we can cut this to get out. Sorry. And sorry for all that boxes on the floor. Poor boxes. So this is the sacrifice room. Ooh. All the blood that is past and present is here. Ooh. Really red blood. That must mean it's fresh. Or is that the case? Or is like light bread, uh, light blood is fresh? I don't know very much about blood. Hmm. We might not be able to do another ending. <gasps> What a shame. Crap. I'm getting really scared now. I don't know if this is a great decision. Shit, shit. Crap my pants. Crap my pants. Shit my pants. <gasps> you said you'd explain everything. What really happened to Elizabeth? You're not making any sense. What's going on here? Are you that dense? I'm not your father. To be honest, I'm surprised you could be. What? Your father died with you. My father's sister is so bad. Couldn't handle the guilt, I guess. He's such a coward. Who are you? I was about to say, he didn't sound like your father. So I don't know why you believed him. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I'm leaving. Not, not so fast. I need to prepare you for the ritual. You better run. <laughs> uh. Oh god! Oh god! Shit! Crap, 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 crap! Boom! Go, go, go! <gasps> Shit! We're so dead. Yeah! <gasps> crap! 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 Oh God! No! 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 <gasps> oh! Well, snooze you lose. <laughs> ah! <gasps> Oh my god. Those have been intense. Come on. A couple of miles left. Put the names in here, and I'll pick one at random. Alright. Let's get this over with. What? Why are you looking at me like that? It's Elizabeth. Huh? That that's not possible. William, you know the rules. Elizabeth must be the next sacrifice. Please. Please, don't do this, I beg you. Sorry, but we can't just back out. When my wife was chosen last month, I ex 
accepted it. That's the risk of something like this. I... I won't let you do this. She's my only daughter. If you resist, then I'll make sure that the rest of your family's next. It's in your best interest to just let this happen. You'll regret it if you don't. Here, Elizabeth. I want you to have this necklace. It's very pretty. I like it very much. Thank you, Daddy. It's for your ceremony in a few days. I want you to look nice. You'll be able to leave soon, Elizabeth. Just lie down on the table and drink this. After I finish, can I go home? Yes, of course you can, dear. This will only take a minute. As I found my way out of the mines, I decided I'd never look back. I had my answers. There was nothing more for me here. I wandered along the road for almost a day before stumbling upon a carriage. They kindly took me back to London. Through documentation and letters, I discovered my mother was still alive living alone in a small flat in Oxford. She was surprised to see me, and the stress of old age was replaced with relief and happiness. She took me to Elizabeth's grave, in a town not far from Crescent Village. We stood there in silence. All was well. At least, until the nightmares started again. The dreams, they didn't stop. They haunted me like before. I just couldn't seem to let go of my past. There was still something I had to do. There was something I missed. Weeks passed, until one day in the morning paper, an article caught my eye. Body found, mutilated beyond identification. The location was near Crescent Village. They were hungry. There were no sacrifices for them to feed on anymore. I realized what I had to do. I pushed for the reopening of the mines in Crescent Village, claiming they were still rich with materials. The newly reopened mines attracted many workers and their families, desperate to make some money. Crescent Village was populated again. I started bringing the demons their sacrifices, one by one. It was difficult at first. I remembered what the man from the mines told me. The end justifies the means. I realized that this was for the greater good. It had to be. This was my destiny. Eventually, sacrificing became routine. I started staying to watch the creatures feed upon their victims. Such elegance in the way that would tear the flesh. Such beauty when the blood flowed out in streams. They were satisfied. And oddly, so was I. Well, that took a turn for the worse. So that was the Amnesia Custom Story. I really enjoyed this. But first, I need to get my opinion on what, uh, what just happened with that ending. So it looks like our character did look back at the past. Ah, psychopath. Yeah. Ew, he's... Yeah, so, he's creepy. So, the main character is, after all, evil. Well, at first, it kind of made sense why he had to do it. But after he said that line, I kind of have a satisfaction. I don't know. I hate him. I don't like him anymore. He's gross. Okay, I don't hate him, but I don't... Actually, I do hate him. I, I hate all of them. Besides, the only people that are truly the nicest characters, in my opinion, is the mother and the daughter. They... They both... Uh, <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> what happened? A sly... A, a, a sly? No, a fly came out of nowhere. Not really. I don't know what happened. <laughs> but, um... But, uh... But, um... 
Yes, the mother and the daughter. Mainly the daughter. I don't know very much about... They didn't really mention very much about the mother. But if I was the mother, I would just... When I found out about this information, I would do nothing to him. I, I would just book it. I would just book it to another country and live there. And he, if he finds me, then we'll do the same thing again. <laughs> thank you for playing. No, thank you for making it again. Or uh, for, for making this custom story. Sorry, I'm, I, I'm having trouble speaking today. Good lord. But thank you for making this custom story. I really enjoyed it. And now for my opinion on the custom story and uh, what I liked about it. This was really good. I really enjoyed this. Um, as much as... I'm sorry, I got close to the microphone. It's uh, the end. As much as uh, there were some things I didn't like, uh, ow, I can't think of what things I didn't like. I didn't like that they didn't narrate the notes. I really wish that they narrated the notes. But, uh, that's, you know, it's fine. You know. Um, at least they, uh, at least they narrated, uh, the, the voice acting. And besides, I can't really judge them for not doing the, or for doing, not doing the notes. Because, you know, this stuff is hard. And it's probably hard to put voice lines. Especially, uh, put them correctly in line. So, um, so I can't really blame them for doing that. But... I will say that uh, that they uh, did do a very good job with the custom story. It was a lot of fun and nothing really bad. I, I really enjoyed this. I can't really say very much. I really enjoyed this. I thought nothing was wrong with it. And I honestly had a fun time. So, yeah. So, thank you very much, creators, for making this. And thank you very much for uh, from you. Uh, for you uh, fr thank you very much to you guys for watching this series. Sorry it took a while to do part two. But... But, you know, things happened, but, uh, but I'll try to do it quick. I'll try to do another parts a little bit more faster than I did, uh, than I did with this series, so. So, yeah, so anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you, everyone. Mm, excuse me. Thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day, and we're gonna go into today's video. So, thank you for watching. Goodbye! <gasps> And thank you very much to Electric Red. Uh, thank you very much for making this. Uh, I really enjoyed it. That's the creator's name, by the way. I'm sorry I didn't mention that earlier. But thank you very much for making this custom story. I really, really enjoyed it. So thank you. Anyways, that was that custom story. And I can't wait to play uh, the other one. And yes, I forgot the name of the custom story. I'm sorry about that. But um, but thank you for making it um, either way. And yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's it. Nothing else to say. So thank you for watching. Have a nice day. And goodbye. <gasps>